<laughs> Welcome back to Good Day Valley. Now Adriana Trevino, she's on a special assignment. So let's go ahead and talk about weather this morning. Now, what are we expecting throughout the state of Texas? As of this morning, we do have cloudy skies. Now we're expecting warm temperatures by this afternoon and also into the weekend. But we're also expecting that cold front hitting our area, bringing not only those cooler temperatures into south of Texas, but also bringing lots of showers, rain throughout, especially around the east in East Texas. Now let's go ahead and take a look here because what we're having lately and especially throughout the week, we're having those of fog advisories especially down here around 281, so be careful. And as we're expecting that cold front to hit our area, we'll be expecting some showers. Also, we're expecting some windy days and for the following week. But now let's go ahead and talk about this morning. I know you're ready to step out the door. Those temperatures pretty cool at 63 degrees in Edinburgh. McAllen at 64 degrees. For those of you in Harland and Port of Mansfield and South Padre Island, temperatures are around 61 and 66 degrees. Now for those of you in Stark County, good morning to you. 64 and 65 degrees. Very pleasant temperatures this morning. By this afternoon, we'll continue to have those warmer uh, temperatures into our area as of this morning. I have partly cloudy skies, which will continue to be partly cloudy throughout the day, except for that fog this morning. That advisory goes on until 9 o'clock today. And so now let's go ahead and take a look to our uh, this afternoon's temperatures, your highs at 85 degrees for Zapata, Roma, and Rio Grande City at 86 for this in Santa Elena and close to Falfurias at around 84 and 85 degrees. And basically throughout the Rio Grande Valley, those temperatures will be in the mid 80s along the coast. Much, much pleasant at 79 degrees and that breeze coming in with those winds, southeast winds at 15 to 25 miles per hour. Now, let's go ahead and take a look to our extended weather forecast because these temperatures will change by the following week. Now, let's go ahead and take a look here. We have mainly sunny skies by the afternoons and those temperatures continue to warm up at 85 degrees. Your lows at 60 degrees. But let's take a look at that Monday, next Monday and Tuesday, 69 and 65 degrees for your highs, your lows at 44 and 45 degrees. So for those of you that have been waiting for this much needed cold into our area, we'll expect those temperatures to drop up to 44 and 45 degrees. And by Wednesday and Thursday, we'll look at that 66, 74, and by the evening, 53 degrees and 63. I mean, it's amazing. I'm ready to take my coats out, those uh, warm-ups and all the, all the things you need for that cold. The sweaters, the coats, your minks, your yeah, it's scarves, amazing. your hats. I, I usually like it, you know. <laughs> and usually on my way to work, I try to bring a blanket because I can't stand those cold <laughs> temperatures at 3 o'clock in the morning. Or in the